Oh, hey there, Nemesis. How are you doing today? Well, you know, Tom, I've, I've had it kind of rough for the last couple of days. Really? Uh, what seems to be the issue? Well, I've, I've got something I'd like to talk to you about. Really? Yeah. All right, well, um, Nemesis, what seems to be on your mind? You know, Tom, it's been a while since we've done a skit. I'm feeling kind of left out here. I mean, you do stuff all the time with these other Transformers, and I'm your mascot. Why can't you do more things with me? After all, I'm a Prime. I do prime time things. That'd be a good name for me, Prime Time. Nemesis, do you really want me to do something? Yeah, I do. It's time we did something. You asked for it. No, 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 you promised you'd never do this again. Ah! Ah, my head, make it stop. No! That's it. I've had enough. I'm not going to take this anymore. Tom, you're going to have to find a new mascot. Where are you going? Wait a minute. Hang on. Nemesis. Excuse me, Tom, but did I just hear Nemesis Prime say he quit as your mascot? Uh, yes, mind wipe, he just quit. I would like to interview for the position. Uh, mind wipe, I'm not sure this is exactly what you think it is. I will be a great help to you. Great help to you. <laughs> yes, Mindwipe, you will be a great help to me. Good. Soon I will have your entire collection in the palm of my hand. <laughs> Yes, mind wipe, whatever you say. <laughs> do, 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 do. Cybertron, bad day, good news. The cutting edge show designed with you in mind. With your special hosts, Chromia. Starscream with Meteorologist Swoop Cybertron Bad Day Good News Welcome back to another exciting episode of Cybertron Bad Day Good News I'm Chromia with my co-host Starscream Hello everyone and today we have a very important story to cover with you. Nemesis Prime and Tom have broken up! That's right, Chromia. It seems that unreconcilable differences have resulted in the disillusion of the partnership between Tom and his mascot, Nemesis. CBDGN's very own RC snagged an exclusive interview with Nemesis Prime just hours after the breakup. So tell me, Nemesis, why did you separate from Tom? Well, you know, Tom is a great guy, but we simply had creative differences in the way he wanted to do reviews. That sounds really unfortunate. Yeah, we left on good terms, though. CBDGN has exclusive footage of your breakup with Tom. Wait, what? Hold on a minute. Roll audio. Nemesis, where are you going? Wait a minute. Hang on. Nemesis! I thought you said you left on good terms over creative differences. This interview is over. Spinster! This does seem pretty bad, Starscream. Indeed, but they have had bad patches before. I'm sure they will pull through. Let's hope so. And now, our own meteorologist, Swoop, will give us the most accurate and current weather report for the planet. Swoop? It going to rain. You heard it here, folks. Rain in the forecast. 
Now, in other news, it seems that Optimus Prime has died again. Not again. Viewers want to know how you got this way. Damn it. Oh, if you must know. One day, while I was still a young Prime, and eh, about three million years ago, I was walking down the streets of Nucleon, a city in the Northern District, and happened to come across a friendly female. Hello there, little Prime. Would you like to come back to my residence for a piece of Candy's Energon? I don't know if I should. I'll give you two pieces. Sweet! Let's go! That was the last time I would see the streets of Nucleon as a child. Soon, I was strapped and chained to a pillar, where she did completely unspeakable things to me. The most horrible thing she did to turn me evil was to make me watch early Earth television programming. In today's exciting episode, Ugh starts a fire. No, no, I can't take it anymore! Make it end! But in the end, I began to like that horrible dribble coming from Earth. Now go, my little prime, and be the evil creature I know you can be. <laughs> and then there was that time I met Metroplex. <laughs> Holy crap, you're a big guy. Hello up there! Yes, what do you want? What kind of transformer are you? I am Metroplex. I am a city bot. You're a city bot? Are your rooms rent controlled? Yes. Do you care if I'm evil? No, as long as you do not use a hot plate in the room. I make no promises, I'm evil. Sign the lease. Do -do 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 -do. Let's see, I'm looking for 73. Ah, oh, crap. Neighbor, yay! Ah, get the hell off me! <laughs> Damn it, Metroplex! You didn't say anything at all about Junkions! Don't be racist. And of course, let's not forget all the crazy crap Tom's put me through over the years. Tom, I really don't think me touching this generator is a good idea. I think it's a great idea, Nemesis. I think it'll make a really good skit. I don't. Don't make me do this. Uh, I'm glad you don't have a say in the matter. Ah! Damn it, Tom! Let's do that again. Ah! <laughs> I'm not even touching this one. Spinster! I am Nightmare Moon. Yes, I know you're Nightmare Moon. Man, you're pushy. Look, I appreciate who you are, and I like your style. But this relationship just won't work out. I mean, I'm a bot, and you're some type of magical horse. There's just no way that would, that would be compatible. Poof! Something went wrong, Spinster! Is there anything I can do to help you out? I believe that 
I'll just stick around with you for a while, if that's okay. Uh, I I'm not sure that's a good idea. Maybe we should rethink this. Oh no. I think you and I are going to spend a lot of quality time together. Lots and lots of quality time. Ah, spinster! Hey, can that stuff make me better? What do you mean? Just look at me. Uh, can that stuff turn me back into the prime I used to be? Vitamin John can turn you into anything. I'll take some. Okay. Nom 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 nom. Poof. Another satisfied customer. The hell did you do to me? What? I'm not good. What do I look like, Optimus? Ah, spinster! <laughs> hey, have you stopped selling that vitamin John yet? Ah! Ah, what the hell did you do? No! Another satisfied customer. What do you mean satisfied? Ah, spinster! <laughs> Aw, oh, nuts. Why does this stuff always happen to me? Ah, spinster! First, let me take a selfie. Do 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 do. Thank you both for coming. I think it's important that we try and work together to try and stop Mindwipe from completely taking over Tom. Is that even possible? And where are the other armored units? They refuse to come. It looks like it's going to be up to us. You know that I am no coward, but I don't want to throw my life away needlessly. At some point, Tom will return to his senses and we will be put on a shelf where we belong. We just can't take that chance. Tom's completely under Mind Wipe's control. We've got to do something about it. We're primes, after all. Well, I'm a prime, and you're not, but... You could be, someday. This is a threat unlike any we have ever faced before. We're gonna have to work together. You will destroy them. Completely and utterly. Yes, mind wife. I will destroy them utterly. Ah, no! Ah, help! Why, Tom? I just don't know what to do, Spinister. Tom's getting all out of control. It's all Mind Wipe's fault. Go back to Tom. Holy crap, Spinster. You can talk. Do 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 do. Okay, Mind Wipe. It's time for you to give Tom back to me. Back to you. I simply moved into a vacant area. You had left him. Yeah. Well, this gun right here says Tom's mine. I'm tired of you messing with him and making him destroy his collection. It's time for you to pay. That's what you call knocking his block off. What the hell just happened?
What the hell are you? A minicon? No, I am the headmaster. Tom, I know you and I have had our differences, but you can't let this little bastard get control of you again. It's time for you to wake up. Tom, wake up! Huh? What? Ah! Nemesis, what's going on? My head, it hurts so bad. Yeah, Tom. That mind wipe, he took control of you. But I kicked his butt. I knocked his head right off. Uh, you know he's a headmaster, right? He can hop back right on his transector and right back there he is. Well, then I guess I'll just keep fighting him. Ma hold on, hold on. Maybe I can help. It's about damn time. Yeah, I'm liking this armor. I'm really digging it. Now to take it to Mind Wipe. Now to just get back into my transector and take back control of Tom. <laughs> Mind Wipe has been defeated. Now things can go back the way they used to be. Nemesis, are you sure you want things to go back the way that they were? Absolutely. I deserve it. Okay, you asked what for What just it. happened? Oh, nuts. You put me back in the little body again, didn't you? Where's my armor, damn it? You said you wanted everything to go back the way that it was. Oh, nuts. Well, I guess I'll have to wait another two years before I get to wear armor again. Yeah, probably every bit of. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, there you have it, folks. Tom and Nemesis have worked through their differences and are now back together. Indeed. After the way Nemesis fought for Tom, and by proxy all of us, it seems that the bond between them can only grow stronger. I agree. Well, that concludes our program for today. I'd like to thank my co-hosts, Starscream and Swoop, for another uplifting episode of Cybertron, Bad Day, Good News. Until next time. Thank you for watching my Papa's channel. Please subscribe and like. Thank you. <laughs> Tom. He's never around when you need him.